Hey, welcome to the show. All you need is some coins. Hello, kitty. How you doing? And uh, a smart cat, cat like this. Sorry, I got the hiccups today. And uh, what you need is the coins. Um, it can be plastic coins or coins from your bedroom or your mom and dad. I made up a worksheet like this. And what it is, I made a couple squares up. I made one, two, three, four, five, six, seven squares with some spaces down below here. So what you want to do is um, empty your bag of coins out here. Doesn't matter what they are. Um, for now, we're just going to use quarters, dimes, nickels, and pennies. Now the trick is, is that when you're adding coins, you always want to add the biggest coin first. And so you want to lay out your coins. And of course, a, a quarter is bigger than a dime, a nickel, and a penny. Let's go ahead and put our coins right here. So you got to put the quarters, then the dimes, the nickels, and then the pennies. <laughs> Make sure you check out my other videos on here. Um, I have a lot of math videos and drawing videos. So let's get started here. Um, so now what you want to do is you're going to add the quarter here. You're going to put 25 cents. Okay. You're going to take 25 cents plus another quarter which is 50 cents. 50 plus a dime? That's right. That's right. 60 cents. 60 plus another dime? You're right. 70 cents. 70 plus a nickel? You're right. 75. 75 plus a penny? 76. 76 plus another penny? You're right. 77. So what we're going to do is we're going to do this uh, again. So I go ahead and put the quarter down, another quarter. And sometimes people want to put um, a nickel here first and then the dime, just because the nickel looks like it's bigger than the dime. But no, the nickel is worth five cents and the dime is worth 10 cents. So switch that around. Go ahead and put our pennies. What I like to do is put the value of the coin right above there. So let's go ahead and do that first. Quarter is 25. Another quarter is 25. Another quarter is 25. The dime is 10 cents. I think the cat is going to be throwing all my money down on the floor. <laughs> and our nickel is 5 cents. Penny is 1 cent. Another penny is 1 cent right there. Okay, now we can go ahead and add that. So our first coin is 25 cents. Okay, plus another 25 cents is, you're right, 50 cents. 50 plus another 25, 75. 75 plus 10, 85. 85 plus 5, 90. 90 plus 1 is 91. 91 plus another one, 92. See how fun this is? We have 92 cents and a cat that is throwing my coins on the floor. All right, let's do another one. This is a lot of fun. You can even do this at home. You can uh, get out some money. You know, you can count it and then have your mom or dad come over and check it. So let's do this again, all right? So let's grab some coins. Get seven coins here. All right, count them out. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. What do you want to do? You want to lay out the coins from largest coin to smallest. Let's do that. Quarter is 25 cents. Again, don't get tricked on this. Okay. Even though the nickel looks like it's a little bigger than the dime, the dime is still worth 10 cents. So lay out the dimes first, then the nickels. So even if you have a, a coin and you forgot to put it in its place, all you have to do is just move them over. That cat is in all my shows and it's pretty hilarious. So it loves to be doing math or art with us. Okay, now let's go ahead and put the value of the coin right above there. So we have 25 cents. 
We have a dime which is worth 10 cents. Another dime is 10 cents. Another dime is 10 cents. Nickel is 5 cents. Another nickel is 5 cents. And this other nickel is 5 cents. So get in the habit of counting by fives. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Get in the habit of counting by tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And when you count by tens, try to start with numbers like 15, like 15, 25, 35, 45. And when you use quarters, get in the habit of counting by 25s. 25, 50, 75, 100. 25, 50, 75, 100. It's going to be great practice. All right, let's get started here. We have a quarter, 25 cents. And we also have a cat that's still knocking our money down. <laughs> okay, we got a quarter, that's 25 cents. Then 25 plus 10, 35. I think that cat is going to put all my coins on the floor. All right, 35 uh, plus a dime is 45. 45 plus another dime, 55. 55. 55 plus a nickel, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. 55 plus 5 is 60. 60 plus another nickel, 5 cents, 65. 65 plus another 5, you're right, 70. Okay, so we have 70 cents. So this is super easy, cheesy, lemon squeezy. All right, let's do one more. Grab seven coins. Doesn't matter what kind of coins they're going to be. All right, lay the coins out like this. Arrange the coins by the largest value. Quarter, 25 cents. Another quarter, 25 cents. So get used to looking at quarters like the heads and the tails. Also, I have a great uh, YouTube video on my channel. It talks about the coins and goes into more detail. So I have uh, th three quarters here. I have a dime, 10 cents. Nickel, five cents. Another nickel, five cents. And a penny. So if you need to, you can write the value of each coin on top. If you don't, you don't have to do that if you already have it memorized. Like I say in all my videos, make math fun, then you're going to have fun doing math. Okay, five cents, one cent. All right, let's get counting, all right? We got one quarter, 25 cents. 25 plus 25, 50 cents. 50 plus another quarter, you're right, 75 cents. 75 and a dime, perfect. 85. 85 plus 5. 85 plus 5, 90. 90 plus 5, 95. 95 plus a penny, 96 cents. We have the value of 96 cents. Super cool. Hey, I hope you enjoyed the show today. Make sure you check out my other videos on here. I have some great math videos, great drawing videos. We always have a fun time. And like always, have a fun day. Adios.